Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, it's the world away and it's Wednesday which means we've got issue 52 of Hashit Partworks Build the Terminator. So in this one we're going to be assembling a muscle and putting another pelvic plate in. So just showing you once again what we've got, we've got some muscle sections here or pistons looking just like that, I'll show you on the close up camera over there here as well. And uh, what we're going to be doing, putting these tubes together, we've got another plate to go over the pelvis area here, just the rear section of that there. Uh, so once it's finished, this section is going to be pretty much enclosed of all the plates. And as you can see, we've got the muscle section there. So not too much to do in this issue. In the next issue, uh, we're going to be doing some uh, fit more parts to the torso and pelvis. So it looks like a, uh, a bracket or some sort of description there, and perhaps another muscle part there. Uh, that's going to be coming next week. Uh, I do believe this is going to be a nice quick issue. So uh, without further ado, let's get cracking. Okay, so the first thing we need are these two parts here. Just to let you know, they look lovely, but uh, they are all plastic. So these are plastic and this is plastic. All we're gonna do is we're gonna be holding it this way around because this section here is gonna go through that more open end compared to that end. So this is gonna be going into this section just here. So it will be able to come out the top just like that. Now we're gonna be putting the muscle cap on, which looks like that. This is basically gonna go down this section here and it's gonna fit snugly inside oops put that back on there get out there it's going to fit snugly inside there but they want us to put that in just with a drop of glue just around the outside here to keep it in place they don't want this going nowhere so i'm only going to be putting little amounts of glue on here i'm not going to cake it just in case something changes and <laughs> we've got to move it around but uh, i'm going to put just enough to keep that into place it does hold itself in quite well to be honest with you but once that's in that's what that's looking like there. Then we need to take the muscle connector, which we had in the last issue. This doesn't come in this issue. This was in the last issue. And this is gonna be going into this end over here as well. Again, it doesn't matter what way round it goes in uh, because you are able to turn it. But what I'm gonna do is uh, get this glued in a little bit as well. So once again, I'm just putting some, just around some of the seams, which I know are going to uh, touch the side of the interior of this muscle piece here and then you just push that in and that's not going anywhere so that is the finished muscle piece whoops like that now we need to bring over our big terminator so i'm just going to lie him down gently because we're going to be putting another plate in now if you look at the pelvis area here we've done all the plate work for that but we have got another hole on the other side so let's turn him over nice and gently and it does help but I'm going to show you what I've done here because I did mention it or allude to it in one of the past issues. I've put a G clamp on here. It adds like a headrest for both sides. So I'm not, you know, like giving too much pressure to the whole thing. Uh, but this is basically just going to be going onto this section here. It's going to be following the contours of what we've already got as it goes around there. I'm going to try and show you that on my close up camera here. So it looks just like that. And as you can see, we've got some pegs on here. And all we're going to be doing is pushing the pegs into these holes that we've got here. Now, it doesn't need glue. So once we push this in, it should hold itself in, which it's done, as you can see, really perfectly there. And that's pretty much the pelvic area complete. So what with that and the muscle that we've done just here, that's all there is to do in this issue. Nice quick issue, huh? <laughs> So there we go. Now, tomorrow we are going to stick with Hashet. We're going to be doing the next part of the uh, Bismarck build, which I believe is just a lower piece of deck. So that's going to be another nice quick video as well. But I really do hope you like that video. I hope you like my new display at the back there. I've changed things around a little bit. Uh, just going forward to the future, as I said, because we've got the model railway thing starting in March. So uh, just to give you a heads up on that as well. But if you like this video, please remember to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed already, please remember to subscribe. Other than that, take care.